All right, next up, guys, I got uh, Xavier Valade. Ryan, why don't you go ahead and start us off? How are you guys doing? Xavier, obviously, this one came down to the wire, and you guys needed to deliver a two minute drill drive. What did you see from Sean in the huddle in terms of just his poise and confidence in that situation? You said it right there. Well, first off, giving honor, giving honor to God for, you know, a great hard fought game and, you know, a great uh, team victory. But yeah, you said it, uh, Sean, you know, just uh, all the situations we've been having during fall camp, you know, he just the confidence he's been building up and, you know, just leading us in the right direction, you know, show today. And, you know, uh, we do have a lot more work to do just uh, getting in the film room. But, you know, it starts with our quarterback and the confidence that's, that he that he's having uh, leading uh, this offense. What were they doing to kind of stymie you guys for most of the game and what changed at the end? Really just being able to execute the plays that, uh, you know, that were called in the game plan uh, just, you know, came down to just a little uh, blocks or, you know, just a you know, a, a great read or, you know, if, if 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 it was a misread, you know, I had to make the right read, you know, whatever we had to do uh, to make the to make a good play, uh, a, to make a good play, a great play. So, you know, it just came down just, uh, you know, uh, executing those assignments. X, what was it like to see Vegan on the other sideline? Man, I, I told him before the game, I never thought a day in my life that, you know, this would end up happening. But, you know, it was just like a family reunion today. Uh, but, you know, it's always love at the end of the day. You know, uh, credit to Montana State. They definitely came out here. You know, they put their best foot forward. And, you know, we did the same as well. But, you know, it's always love for Coach Vegan. You know, I, I wish them the best for the rest of the season. Thank you. X, the, uh, the offense kind of struggled to get drives together early, but those last three all went for over 50 yards. What was the biggest change you saw in the offense down the stretch? Really just, you know, believing in one another. You know, I thought that, you know, as long as we do our job and take care of the football, that, you know, we'll always be in uh, great positions to make plays and get the ball to our playmakers. So this uh, comes down to executing those plays and you know, having confidence in one another and you know, just it, uh, just come down to executing those plays at a high level. Excellent. Excellent. Hard to keep your confidence when you guys are one and nine on third downs and three and 12 on third down conversions. I'm sorry? Is it hard to keep confidence when, when you, you're not getting it done on third down like that? No, it's not hard at all. Just that's the, and that's why we practice. You know, uh, the situations, the two minute situations, third down situations. You know, uh, all those situations that we practice in the spring and the, uh, you know, in fall camp and even in the season. You know, in a couple of weeks before, it's just always executing. You know, just believing in guys, just that they'll be in the right position to make plays and the right fits to be in great positions. So. It's not hard at all. It's just as long as we do our job and, you know, do the right assignment that's called um, into the game plan, then, you know, we should always see a success. Are you guys good? Hey, X, X I, I just wanted to ask you what it was like to finally be back out on the field after only playing two home games last year in front of limited crowds and, you know, more than 27,000 in, in the stands today. It felt really good, you know, um, and, and then the most important thing that, that really felt good was just having the fans back, you know, the electrifying atmosphere. I, you know, I definitely missed that, you know, playing another game at home and, and kicking it off right on our season opener with a stripe out and, you know, just seeing all the, you know, emotions going up and every everyone just to, having the excitement that, you know, it's our first game and, you know, it's, it's, it's finally football season is finally here. So. You know, it was a lot of emotions today, and, you know, I'm very thankful that we got a, a victory today.